Howdy, this is Brett. I'm here with Mama Smiths, M A M A S M I T H S dot com. Uh, we're going to do an unboxing of the brand new Pokemon Sun and Moon Elite Trainer Boxes for the trading card game. Uh, we did a unboxing previously and a brief description of the Pokemon game and a couple of differences, how you buy the packs or trainer decks or boosters. Um, so this is a Pokemon Evolutions XY Elite Trainer Box. Uh, we did this one last week and now we're going to open up these. They're pretty similar, just uh, slight differences. Uh, we'll discuss that. Um, if you don't know much about Pokemon uh, or a trading card game, I gotta tell you, it is fantastic. We've been playing it for six days now, and our five-year-old has taken to it incredible. She's learning how to read with it. She's learning how to count and do math with it. Um, so I can't say enough about the mechanics of the Pokemon trading card game. They are so simple, yet fun. We have a blast playing them. So let's get to what's in the Elite Trainer Box. Um, so I'll show you the back of one here. Here's Sun, here's Moon. Uh, here's what the back looks like. So it tells you what comes in it. It comes with eight Sun and Moon booster packs. Each pack contains 10 cards. It comes with 65 sleeves um, that are gonna be different between which box you buy. You're gonna get Solgaleo or Lunala. Uh, and it's gonna come with 45 energy cards, which is great, because if you're buying just boosters, you won't have enough energy cards to really play a game. Uh, you're going to get the player's guide to the expansion. You're going to get six damage counter die, a competition legal coin flip die, two acrylic condition markers, and one acrylic GX marker. So all of those last couple things are great because if you bought some of the older um, just starter decks or the original trainer decks, you get these little cardboard pop-outs for some of these things. So it's definitely nice to have them, um, the die and the acrylic markers. Also different from the Evolutions is the GX marker that's acrylic. Uh, they didn't have GX back in the Evolutions. That's kind of a new mechanic and it should be explained in the guide. Additionally, you get the collector's box, which is what we're about to open, and you get some codes for the trading card game online. If uh, you haven't done the online trading card game, also, additionally, a great resource. It's free um, to start playing. It teaches you how to play. Uh, on the computer, and every time you buy a pack or a box or something like that, you get a code for extras in your game. So new cards, new expansions, stuff like that. So it's actually a really good resource on how to play. So let's go ahead and we're gonna start with the moon. Of course, purple is my favorite. So the first thing is, it slides out, it comes with the player's guide that we mentioned earlier. Uh, the player's guide has got uh, a welcome to the box, explains GX. All right, that's a big part of it. Um, it explains some new Pokemon, and it has a couple of cards that it explains, and a card list and some credits. So here are some of your top trainer cards as you just flip through. Here's the card list for everything that's gonna be in Sun and Moon. Kind of like a little check off, right? Because it shows you there's different types of cards. You have a regular card or your foil type cards. So you could use this as a checklist, right? Because you gotta catch them all, right? Pokemon. All right. A little cardboard here, pop the top. So you can see one thing you notice between the evolutions and the sun and moon was that it was sitting higher. Well, that's just because there's this cardboard to keep everything nice in there. Once it's all together, it will be the same height as the other boxes. So right off the bat, we see we should have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight booster packs. Those are nice. Here's our acrylic. Uh, poison burn and you can see the GX behind there. So, you know, it's got some definitely thickness to it. It feels nice acrylic. So it's not the cardboard pop out. Here's the six die and then the competition legal flip coin, right? So if you know much about it, um, a lot of moves you have to flip a coin for heads or tails. Um, a lot of people instead like to roll the die and do evens for heads, odds for tails. So that's one way to play. We like flipping the coin just because my daughter has fun flipping a coin. So you got those. Uh, here's the dividers. So it comes with four dividers. Um, I'll show you in my evolutions box what the dividers do. So we kind of have divided out different um, maybe decks or colors or um, energy, something like that. Nice way, nice help. So it comes with four dividers for the box. Here's the 45, or correction, 65 sleeves. 
So um, this is very nice. You put your sleeves on your cards so that you don't ruin them. So that's nice. And here's the 45 energy cards. So it's just basic energy cards, um, but definitely nice to have. Like I said, if you buy nothing but boosters, you probably wouldn't have enough energy to play to build a deck. And there's a code in here. So this is for the online game. I'm not gonna show you the back, don't steal my code. So this is for the online game. All right, let's see what we got. Like I said, 10 cards per booster. Again, each one of these has an online code. So when you're all said and done, one box gives you eight codes for the boosters, plus one for the box, you get nine extra codes. This one gives you extra cards. All right, we got a Skarmory, an Apollywag, a Sandy Gast. Oh, an Eevee, Eevee's a good one, all right. A Craballer, Craballer, whatever you wanna call it. An Arcanine, uh, that's a, you see it's a foil card there. I don't know if you can see the shininess to it. Um, I have that in one of my decks that I destroy my wife with, so uh, that's definitely a good one. A Cos, Cosmoine. So I do play Pokemon. Uh, my wife plays Pokemon. My daughter plays Pokemon. The games. Um, so you might be familiar with some of these. You might not. And even if you play it and watch the show, I still mess up on some of the names. So if I've said it wrong, I apologize. Don't attack me. Energy. A trainer card, um, a Dartrix, and another trainer card, a Pokeball. So um, once you get into playing, you might, if you do play already, you already know, but trainers are a major part of your deck. So good trainer cards are a must also on top of the Pokemon. You can't rely solely on strong Pokemon. A Paris, another Poliwog, oh, a Dupider. Another Eevee, a Stuffle, a Foil Tarcoil. Again, that's that's also in my deck uh, that I destroy everybody with. Cloister, some more energy. Ooh, nice one, a double colorless energy. So this is a, gonna be a very good addition to a deck. So uh, once you know much about it, this one card is worth two colorless energy. Very good starter card. Uh, no idea how to pronounce this one. Piaku Muku. So, there you go. That looks like a good one. And a Crocorock. Keep going here. In our evolutions, we got a Mewtwo, a foil Mewtwo. That's fantastic. That just does unbelievable damage. So every once in a while you get some of these really big cards. Pick a peck, another Eevee. So, you know, if we get other stage one and stage two Eevee evolutions, then, um, you know, it'll be a good deck. Psyduck, everybody's favorite if you ever watch the show. A Spiro, a Dratini. Oh, here's a special Grimer. A little, nice little foil Grimer there. Here's a Crabominal. Oops, messed that one up. But it's a stage one that goes on our, where'd our crab go? Ah, I thought I had it. No, nope. oh yeah, right there. It goes on the Craballer. So, that's actually interesting. I never noticed that. It goes from a fight to a water. Huh. Another energy. Uh, here's a nice Brion. And another Cracker Rock. And a Pelipper. So you have your book there and you can have your check box and you can check off which ones you have and then you know, you know how much of the set you have. Another code. A sand dial. Another pick a peck, which I had somewhere else. Oh well, yeah, thank you. Another Spiro, a Fomantis, a uh, Morlal. Oh, all right, we got some good cards here. So here's a, a Foil Trainer, it's a Rotom Dex. After counting your prize cards, shuffle them into your deck, 
Then take that many cards from the top of your deck and put them face down as your prize cards. Okay, interesting. But, check this one out. An Umbreon GX. Wah, 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 wah. So that's a pretty BA card right there. Um, you can see it's got 200 hit points and it evolves from an Eevee. So you're going to place that on top of your Eevee um, and you have a pretty sweet card right there. So I'm going to set that one aside. Got another energy. You don't care about that. Another <laughs> trainer card. A Spinda. And another trainer card, Lily. A Litten, okay, that's a good one. Another Tarquoil, not a, so you can see the difference between uh, regular and the foil or the reverse foil, they call that, because the picture is not foiled. Um, so that's the difference in those. A Yumboos, Rowlet, Cosmog. Uh, here's a foil energy retrieval. So it's just a trainer card, it's a good trainer card. Uh, but it's foil, a little, a little fancy. Oh, here's a good one. Here's a Sharpedo, special Sharpedo foil. Another energy, a trainer card, a crushing hammer, a herdier, and a charger bug. I actually don't know that one. That's pretty cool. I uh, haven't played too much Sun and Moon, to be honest with you. Still playing. What are we playing? Black and white? No. Mm, X and Y. X and Y. X and Y. Yeah. Our daughter has Sun and Moon. So our daughter gets the more advanced stuff. We're stuck with the old stuff. All right. Another Pick a Pack. Another Spiro. Another Fomantis. Another Moral All. Ooh, a Skarmory. Nice. All right. Skarmory. I have one of those in my X and Y that's good. Another trainer how, but this time it's a foil. Oh, a Butterfree, a Vols from a Metapod. That's a good one, it's a stage two. An energy, oh, here's a good one. Rainbow energy. All right, so that's, that's a good one to have because it can provide you whatever color you want, basically. Okay. Another Charger Bug and another Rotom Dex. As a trainer. Okay. All right. Got another pack. Don't look at my code. <laughs> another Cosmog. Another Fomantis. Uh, look, see, here's a regular Grimer, and we had a foil before. Uh, Token Demaru. Please oh, takes a lot of room, huh? A Stuffle. He's somewhere. Right up there. Ooh, very nice. A Hypno. Foil Hypno. All right. Oh, he's cool looking. Hypno's very cool. Okay, there's a Stoutlin. He's the evolution of the Herdier. Uh, basic Energy, a Trainer Experience Share. Here's a Raticate. And a Wishy Washy. All right, last one from this Trainer Box. And I think after this, we'll probably just... Uh, Open the other box and cut to all of them open because it's taking way too long. Oh, a cutie fly. He is a cutie fly. A chin chow. And we're going to run out of space. Another more lol. Another skarmory. Oh, there's a cute little caterpie. Oh, look at this. Ivy's gonna go crazy over this. Our daughter loves Meowth. There's a Meowth uh, and a reverse foil version. Was that a foil? I can't see it. Now. Yes. A Beware. He's cute. Another Energy. A Nest Ball. A Dartrix. That's a stage one on somebody. I think is it on that. And oh, look at that's a good good pair right in the same box, right? Because sees the evolution of the Meowth, the Persian. All right, real quick, I'll show you. We'll open this one. Same thing, player's guide. Okay, open the box here. And 
then we have our eight boosters, acrylics, our card protectors, our basic energy, a code, we have our four dividers, and our die. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and open all these and I'll reveal them all at once just so I don't have to take up extra time. Be right back. And, okay. All right, I just opened the eight booster packs from the sun. I haven't looked at them other than maybe the first one on each pack as I put them down. Um, so let's take a look real quick. What we get, another Ratata. And he goes in that Radike, or was that the, oh, it was the basic version of it. I thought we had it, I guess not. Uh, sand Isle, okay, so he goes with that Crocker Rock. Another pick a -pick. another Spiro. You can see you do, there's some commons you get a lot of, Fomantis. Oh, here's another Psyduck, but a foil version, that's cool. Again, our daughter loves that. Parasect, which goes with this Paris. That's a good one. Uh, basic Energy. Another Trainer, Crushing Hammer. Toracat, which goes with this Arcanine. No, it doesn't. No, Litten. No, it goes with Litten down here. Come on. It's one of my favorites. An Energy Switch. Move a Basic Energy from one of your Pokemon to another one. That's a great Ooh. trainer card. Okay. A Code. A Grubbin which I thought we had somewhere, whatever. <laughs> uh, ooh, Drowsy, okay. That's a classic one. Another Craballer, Craballer, whatever you want to call it. Sandile, there's another Meowth, uh, but not the foil version. Here's a foil wishy-washy. Here's an Incineroar, so you can see there, there's the three stage evolution there from a Litten to a Toracat to an Incineroar, which is in my deck that I destroy everybody yeah, with. Yeah, so. that one kicks my butt all the yeah. time. Uh, an Energy, an Arquanid, okay, so he comes from the Dupider. Where's the Dupider? Mm, I know we had one. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, here's another, or another trainer. Well, I kind of mixed that one up, huh? Spinda! I think that was a new one. A code. Pick a peck. If you wanted a pick a peck deck, you'd definitely get one after this. <laughs> and a sand dial. A snubble. That's a good one. Here we go. A Firo. So that's the evolution from Spiro. Okay. A Grubbin, which I think I just put down there. Oh, yay! A Dratini. All right, that's a, a, a good one if you guys watch the show or play the games. Ooh, here's a, a crocodile. okay? So now we have that whole evolution there, right? Sandal cro crocodile, croc or rock, and a crocodile. all right? So that's the three stages there. A basic energy, a trainer, poison barb, a toracat, a potion, always good to have. A Craballer, we had him somewhere. Yeah, right here. Here's a new one. A um, Mariani. It's got a poison card. It always makes everybody angry when I poison them. Here's a Diglett. There's the Dupider again. Another Meowth. So we definitely have a Meowth deck too. Here's a foil trainer. Here's a beware again. A basic energy, another double colorless energy. So that's definitely gonna be good for the deck. Oh, sweet. Here's a dragon air, okay. It evolves from our Dratini, all right. And everybody remembers Ash riding on his. Trainer, code. Caterpie, I think we had down here somewhere. A Makahita, Chinchow, Togedemaru, oh, a Carvana. Here's a Foil Persian, a Parasect, Basic Energy. I'm being told we're pressed for time here. Charge a Bug, 
Birdier. Here's a Steeny. Surskit. Wingall. Poplio. There's a cute Growlithe. It's a different version. Okay, a Grubbin. Foil Caterpie. Toucanon. Energy. Trainer. Here's a Golbat. Another Dragonair. Code. Pick a pack. Eevee. Psyduck. Spiro. Dratini. Uh, Foil Charger Bug. Cloyster. Energy. Raticata. Wishy Washy. <laughs> Trainer. Wingle. Stuff Fool. Puppilo. Zubat. Shelter. How? Here's a new one. Masquerade. Polyworld. Mm, two seconds. Brio. Timer. Thank you.